The regal of royalty, splendor of culture and tradition, convergence of people from different walks of life and tribes, all were beautifully arrayed at the Oloja Festival in Ilei Fair. The Oloja Festival is used to celebrate the day of creations when according to Yoruba legends and history, God, popularly known as Eledumari in Yoruba, created the first day. Residents and tourists who had come to witness this year's Oloja festival had gathered at the Ile Odua Palace of the Oni of Ife, waiting anxiously for hours to catch a glimpse of the progenitor of the Yoruba race, wearing the sacred Adiare, a crown believed to have been sent down by God when he created the day, and only won once a year during the Oloja festival by every sitting Oni of Ife. The height of the festival came when Oni Adeyeyi Ogunwusi, or Jaja II, whose turn it was to adorn the Are crown for the first time since becoming the 51st Oni of Ife in December 2015, emerged from his Ile Odua Palace to the cheers and shouts of crowds. <laughs> Thereafter, the Oni embarked on the traditional procession to Oke Imogun, the ancestral shrine of Ogun, the Yoruba god of iron, and Idiaje before returning to his palace. Tourists and residents say it is time for government to develop such festivals in the country to find a way out of the current economic downturn due to overdependence on oil. It came at the right time because uh, since uh he was installed as the king of Ileife. You see the development, development going on in Ileife. You know, in terms of uh, opening up, you know, Ileife for visitors. And the first thing he did, I think, which is very, very right, is to declare Ife a tourist zone. This is the crown that was bequeathed to uh, Oni by Odudua. Odudua was the first one that, that wore that crown, and that crown that has been worn by previous Oni, and this is the 51st one. So it's a, it's a special crown that is never seen in any other place in Yoruba land except in Ife. The festival indeed lived up to its billings as one of the traditional festivals in Yoruba land. Today is highly significant in the history of Ife. One, we are having the first Oni, celebrating the first Olojo ever since he ascended the throne of his forefathers. The same thing is applicable to myself as Oshogo. This is my first Odun Olojo. Olojo is a significant festival that will celebrate in Ife, by and large, Ife at home and in diaspora. The Olojo festival is one of the most ancient of festivals in Ile Ife, the acclaimed cradle of the Yoruba race. <laughs>